Hello everybody, my name is Jordan, and today we will be playing Super Smash Flash. This is a Flash game, fan game, of Super Smash Bros, the popular franchise made by Nintendo. And there's a lot of characters you can play as. You can play as Goku. There's also an up there might be an update, like rumors say they might add my Hero Academia, Doria, all that stuff. And yeah, we're gonna get into it right now. When this loads, we're gonna click on to it and see what happens. Before we click on, I just wanna say a couple of things. This is not my work. This is someone else's. I did not create this. Someone really worked really hard to do this. So let's play. All right, Super Smash Flash. It may look a little bit slow because I'm using a bit, I'm using another computer, but it still works the same. All right, let's play. So I had the volume off, but we'll do a group thing for this round. Yeah, and my favorite character is Naruto. If you've seen my if you've seen my YouTube page, you know it is. And we'll vote it against Goku. And then let's pick I don't know where these stages are. Let me just try and find the one I wanna play as. There's Planet Namek. Oh, Hidden Leaf Village. Alright, let's play. So I might only do one round. Because these are a bit long. But don't worry. We will keep on getting to them. This is probably going to be a battle for the ages. So let's just see what can happen, right? Alright. So the first thing I want to note is that the controls are a bit different, not going to lie, they're a bit different, but that's okay. I just wanted to note that because because it kind of looks a bit different, but that's okay. And this kind of this this kind of works as like seeing in slow motion, so I can get to see what happens next, which I'm kind of a fan of. Let me just charge up a rising gun, and it hit. Let me just charge this. So this may take a while. So I may have to do a time skip, and probably not though, because this is pretty laggy. But I'll do this on another computer, so that way. a pretty neat game. It really is, though, because it's pretty amazing how they added 
all these characters into one game. It really is. Like, imagine how much work this must have taken. At least a year. Or maybe two. I think I'm being too generous, but... Actually, I don't think people know how much trouble this goes into it. And they really should recognize it for how good it really is. I know a lot of other YouTubers probably talked about this. But not like this. Like, anyone who said they didn't like this probably doesn't have good taste to begin with. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna do a time skip and I will see you I will see you when So it's been roughly around a couple of minutes since I did the time skip and I have a reason for doing the time skip as well it's because, like, if I didn't do the time skip, then this video would have lasted too long, and I don't want it to. So, we're just gonna keep going to this and see what happens. Because I actually don't know. But let's keep going. So, I've gotten one, I got two stocks off of Goku, which is great, but I do need more, so let's just do that. So, Rasengan is my best move, and Rasen Shuriken is, is the best, better move, so we're going to have to be doing that a lot, but Naruto does that a lot anyway. New Bardo, he doesn't really do that a lot. He doesn't really do Rasengan a lot. I mean, not he, not Rasengan. He does Rasengan a lot in Bardo. He doesn't do Shadow Clones as much in Bardo. I kind of have a problem with that. I don't know if people will agree with me, but I kind of have a problem with that because. It was the first uh, ninjutsu that he ever used, and a little sad he forgot it, but sometimes you just gotta go with the flow, I guess. Which is fine. I mean, I don't have a problem with that. How did he dodge that if I was standing in front of him? So we're just going to keep going until the seconds come off. So we're charging up our Rasengan, and I'll show you Rasen Shuriken in a second. So he's trapped in this. Alright, that's like... Mainly the first damage he's actually got on me, which is great. Goku's first attack that actually lands. Or is it his third attack that landed? After this, I may come down because it's because it, this is a long video by itself. So this match just about to end. So yeah, I've gotten enough, I've got enough stocks on him to win, and another thing I want to point out is a roster, like, normal Smash Bros would never allow Waluigi, 
He has Waluigi, Bomberman, basically everyone you want in Smash that Nintendo will never give us. And who can blame him? It takes a lot more work than you might think. So, but when you see this, when you see that, when you see a new character re release trailer, just know that Nintendo worked really hard on that to do. And we should respect that. I know I sound a bit tired, because I am, but it's okay, and this match is about to end, so I'll see you later, have a good time, and yeah, goodbye.